German automakers were breathing a collective sigh of relief Friday as a new three-party coalition government appeared to hold off from radical action that might have brought an earlier-than-expected demise to new internal combustion engine ICE, vehicle sales. Environmentalists didn't like the failure to finally end Germany's lack of a speed limit on some highways and wanted higher taxes on ICE cars. The industry feared a commitment to end the sale of new ICE cars by 2030. The new government wants to bring forward the end date from a European Union proposal of 2035, but failed to add detail. Britain has already committed to ending new ICE car sales by 2030, but so far no other major European producer has followed suit the German federal election September 26, using proportional representation, produced an inconclusive result. It took two months to negotiate the terms of a coalition government, but this was about four months quicker than the last government led by outgoing Chancellor Angela Merkel. The coalition government, between the center-left Social Democrat Party of new Chancellor Olaf Scholz, the Greens and the free market FDP, announced a target of 15 million battery electric vehicles on Germany's roads by 2030. That's the equivalent of about one. 6 million new BEVs a year, implying a BEV share well above 50% by the end of the decade, according to investment bank UBS. The current government BEV subsidy of up to 9 euros, 000, 10 dollars, 200, will remain until at least 2025. The coalition government also aimed to make sure there were 1 million charging points in Germany by 2030 and energy was 80% renewable. Currently, coal provides 24% of German power, casting a shadow over its claims to be green. Coal will ideally be phased out by 2030 compared with the previous government's target of 2038. According to Reuters, BMW liked the new proposals, especially the charging plans. Daimler was impressed too. When I first glanced through the coalition agreement, I liked the sound of three numbers, 15 million electric cars, a million charging points and 80% renewable energy, Reuters quoted Daimler CEO Ola Kalenius as saying. Reaction on the stock market was hard to fathom, as prices dived across the world on renewed fears of a sudden spread in the coronavirus threat. The overall German stock market, measured by the DAX index, dropped nearly 3%, while the Euro stocks Auto 600 slid almost 5%. BMW was quoted at 86 euros. 38, off 5. 2% and Daimler at 83 euros. 67 down 5. 3% by mid-afternoon.